All right. Tonight's book is The Book with No Pictures, and it's by B.J. Novak. And this book is going to teach us a little bit about how books can be made and why authors make books and how powerful it is to be an author. Let's see. The Book with No Pictures. This is a book with no pictures. It might seem like no fun to have someone read you a book with no pictures. That's what I was thinking. It probably seems boring and serious, except. Here is how books work. Everything the words say, the person reading the book has to say. no matter what. That's the deal. That's the rule. So that means even if the words say, uh-oh, I'm getting nervous. Flork. Wait, what? That doesn't even mean anything. Flurf. Wait a second, what? This isn't the kind of book I wanted to read. And I have to say, every single word the book says, uh-oh. I am a monkey who taught myself to read. Hey, I'm not a monkey. And now I am reading you this book with my monkey mouth in my monkey voice. That is not true. I am not a monkey. Yes, I am a monkey. Also, I am a robot monkey. What? And my head is made of blueberry pizza. Wait a second. Is this whole book a trick? Can I stop reading, please? No? And now it's time for me to sing you my favorite song. A song? Do I really have to sing a... <gasps> glug, 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 my face is a bug. I eat ants for breakfast right off the rug. What? This book is ridiculous. Can I stop reading yet? No? There are more pages? I have to read the rest? Oh. My only friend in the world is a hippo named Boo Boo Butt. Boo Boo Butt? And also, the kid I'm reading this book to is the best kid ever in the history of the entire world. Oh, really? And this kid is the smartest kid, too. Because this kid chose this book, even though it had no pictures. Because kids know this is the book that makes grown-ups have to say silly things. Well, that seems true. And make silly sounds like... Oh no, here it comes. Glur. Face. Oh my goodness. Please don't ever make me read this book again. It is so silly. In fact, it's completely and utterly preposterous. Next time, please, 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 please choose a book with pictures. Please, because this is just too ridiculous to read. Let's see if I can get to the last page. The end. Bonk. I didn't really want to say that.
now we know that books, the author controls what the reader of the book says because the words that you say always have to match with the words that the author wrote.